Hey guys, you're probably wondering where have I been? Well, today I went for uh, a local dance um, workshop today, so yeah, it was pretty fun. So, apart from that, I'm going to make another review. It's been a week or two. And yeah, I just finished off, just finished off watching Infinite. Bad. Wow, how I wish to make a reaction because Sunkyu looks so handsome. I don't and L looks adorable as always. He, mm, yeah. And then you have the hot mess of all. Hiya. Oh, yeah. oh my god, Hiya. Oh yeah. What does he do to me? Why? <laughs> and precisely, there was a poster of Hoya during the workshop. Uh, they were giving out posters. I didn't get one because, uh. Yeah. Didn't get one, but. There was a post of Hoya. I think not everyone wanted one, but Hoya. Oh my God, no! He looked. Mm, he was in it to win it. Especially, he's one of my bias, along with L, because L was one of his names to remember and his face, so you know which one's L, since he looks a bit like L from Death Note. So. You get the point, yeah. And then Hoya got into my life, like, as if it, it was like an arrow. Just like, you know, the Valentine's Day, like, you get one of them and go, Poof! Yeah, that's, he's one of them. You just got the Cupid just, just checking on you. And yeah, that, that's how what happened. A Cupid just attacked me because of Hoya. And that's what happened. And I have the Hoya feels. Hoya just literally just made my life, just a amount of seconds ago, just... We've been tantrum the, the the I just messed up the the delivery area because of Hoya. Thanks. Now I'm hungry because pego payo, chunun pego payo, which means I'm hungry now because of Hoya. Exactly. Apart from that, what makes it more? Oh my God! Is that? Is this infinite? Like. Oh wow! Like I never expected Infinite to go to that direction of a concept, a different sound. I was like, I expected to be like you know like I'm back and stuff. Like I'm back, Romeo and the other songs they did did before, the Chaser and stuff like kind of typical the Infinite. But I never expected this. It was so good! Wow, I was just in shock. I, 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 I was in, I was, I was, I'm still in process. That is it. What was this? What I just watched was an infinite video, infinite song. It's, it wasn't hip hop, and it wasn't your typical K-pop boy band that kind of cutesy and stuff. It wasn't R and B, ish. It was deaf. It, it was. It wasn't even rock music. It was none of those things. It wasn't like trying to be C Clown, trying to be BTS or Top Dog or BAP. I, I can't explain. I can't even describe how different it sounds for Infinite to go to that direction. I'm just mind blown, basically. My mind is literally just exploded in shock. Oh, how much they change, how much they progressed. I mean, these guys deserve so much credit. Well, they, they are pretty popular, actually, especially it's K-pop. So, yeah, I think they won a couple awards, but, like, TV shows, like, music shows. But if they get to the direction of MTV music, like, EMAs, MTV EMAs, I really wish them, I really would love to see him get an award from there and, you know, Grammys, the Brits Awards, I mean, because these guys are, I, I know you guys will start bashing on me because of what I just said about the awards, but, but don't get me wrong, it's, 
yeah, we can have many as artists because there's so many K-pop songs, so many K-pop artists that have they need so much credit because they're so different and they're very versatile and very talented. I mean, I don't want to mention the under the under rated groups that are so good and they're not getting in, enough credit for it. But Infinite is one of those really good groups that are really well appreciated because it's different and because it's infinite. I mean, infinite is nothing like Big Bang and nothing like Vex. Although this was this this was a pretty dark concept, I must say. So it would it was a dark concept. I must I think I think this is a dark concept, but but at least it's different. Uh, it, they 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 don't not disappoint me. I mean, three years ago, or actually it was two years ago, when I found out, when I learned about Infinite, I started to to listen to their earlier songs. So that's how I got into their music. And then then along came Chaser, and then the other songs, the future songs like Destiny. I was obsessed with Destiny. I mean. It was legend. That song is legend. I mean, I know some people, some of you guys may not agree, but I really love that song so much. It's crazy. It's a bit ooh, out of my mind. But then the new songs last year, they were good as well. I really particularly loved. I really love I'm uh, Back, which was gold. It was gold. And then this year... You never expected this. Oh, that's even golder. I mean, it's r super gold this year for Infinite. I mean, oh, I really hope. I really hope like many people around the world can take uh, or or not just say trying to copy them, but take as uh, Infinite as an inspiration for their music because they really are one of them groups that are giving a that kind of music. I don't know how to explain it, but I'm trying my best to to explain what I'm trying to get. I'm not because I know a lot of people do plagiarizing and copy and pasting and all that kind of nonsense. But taking someone as a group from a different country as an inspiration, I think Infinite is one of them groups that should be for many artists around the world to be should be that one group, one of them groups to be an inspiration for many people around the world. I think <sighs> I can't get over the fact that my, in my head is Hoya's image. Like, thanks, Hoya. Thank you. God bless your face because Hoya is just <sighs> Hoya. Oh my God. He's becoming my ultimate bias. That's not good. It is good. <laughs> I mean, he is one of my bias, so he's slowly becoming my ultimate. So, ultimate. So that is all, you guys. I know I spoke pretty much a little bit longer. So, tell me what did you think of the song? Did you like it? Did you hate it? Was there something in particular you were just like me? You was really shocked that the fact it was was this the infinite song? Wow, it's so different. Because to, to be honest, it, it doesn't sound like any of the previous Infinite songs. So this this song could be the song they will win awards for the main for many reasons. Because it sounds so good. So please leave your comments down below. Any f your opinions, uh what do you think of the song? Uh what do you think of the members? How good because they looked so good. Every single one of them. Especially Stun Q looked flawless. L looks like L because L never changes except for his hair, but his face is still the same. But the rest of them, I forgot the name. If you, for you commenters down below, if you're an Infinite fan, please <laughs> remind me the name. I forgot. I for, I know he's from Infinite H, but I forgot his name. Apart from Hoya, he's one of the group, but the other guy. But with that said. That is all you guys, um, I hope you can enjoy the videos uh, that I kind of give up on YouTube and stuff, that's, yeah, you'll see as me 
today I haven't been having a different hairstyle since I was dancing, so I decided to put like this. So I'll call it the Chungli the Chungli uh hairdo. So that is all you guys. Please remember to subscribe my channel, like this video, share this video. Also, um for those who are for uh, for you for, to follow me on my uh I would like you to follow me on my social media such as Twitter, Instagram, uh Tumblr and MySpace and also like my fan page. I have now two fan pages now. Officially have two fan fan page on Facebook. So one of them will be Amy Jane Palencia. The other one is for the actors crew member I'll just get that in a minute so for for those in my original one is called Amma Jane Palencia so you just like my fan page on that and also please remember to for the people who are into crews want to be a part of a crew of filming directing producing makeup artists all those kind of things are uh, please remember to follow me or add me on uh, sorry, add me on chaney.com, hive.com, and also on LinkedIn, you'll find me as Amma Jane Palencia, and as like I said before, I have a new fan page, which is the web series project, you will just see, you will see a face of me, wearing Monkey D. Luffy hat, so you just like, and if you, for those who are into acting and stuff, you can leave a comment, leave or oh, leave questions. You can ask me questions about what project I'm up to. So I'll give out as much as I can information. So with that said, um, also please remember to for those who like stories, like fan fiction, like K-pop fan fictions, anime fan fictions, fantasy, love stories, kind of romantic comedy kind of thing going on or based on true stories or anything like that any stories that fan fictions or non fan fictions please remember to follow me on Wattpad, DeviantArt and on Asian Fanfix and I have to remind myself because I sometimes you know we all forget things uh, please remember to um, since I'm up for the Watties Award 2015 it will be over until August so please remember to um, to uh, read my stories, vote for my stories, and also leave a comment on comments on my story uh, stories because I've got three stories that's up for it. So you'll see uh, the title with the hashtag is 2015 Or you can also read the stories that are not up for it. I don't mind as long as you leave comment on the ones that are up for it. I'm fine and. With the normal ones, I'm fine with it. Um, I hope you enjoy my stories. So that is all, you guys. Annyeong, everyone. Antalangke.